Hello and welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution 2. And um, when we left off, we were just uh, bringing in some escaped dinos uh, ready for um, leveling up to uh, asset rating uh, to 3,000. So we've got 2,000 at the moment, so we need to bring some more assets in. Um, l last dinosaurs we brought in are five Paralophosauruses. These little guys, look at them. Adorable, right? Just beautiful creatures. There we go. So they are all fully happy in their enclosure. It's all sorted. And we've got a, um, uh, what's it called? Set up in it. Um, what are they called? They're in here. A ranger post. We've already got one set up in here. So they're going to, ranger's going to go around and do all of these on his own. We also got, actually, I think after we got, was it before or after? We got the Ankylosaurs as well. So we got two of them. And they're doing fine as well. These are big old brutes. But they're really, like, herbivores and super friendly. So they should be fine. I doubt we'll have them trying to break out or anything anytime soon. The ones that we do have to worry about are, what's going on? I need to... There we go. Uh, are the Allosaurus, which is down here. Mr. Al here. And then these two Carnotosauruses. Their like, place looks absolutely just barren, doesn't it? But they love it. So we're just going to leave it like that. Um, so I've got to think where I want to put... We probably want to bring in some more herbivores. Um, and we'll put them around here. I'm guessing so first things first is to send some people out on an expedition and see what we've got so we've got uh free diplodocus they're gonna need a lot of space but they are quite cool sinoceratops oh, i don't even know how to say that one dinion dinonicus dionicus um, Baryonyx, so those two are carnivores, so we probably want to hold off on the carnivores for now. One Brachiosaur, very cool. Chasmosaurus and Taurosaurus. So I'm going to go with the three Diplodocus. And how much do we need to get them? Six. So these guys, Hook and Burhan can set off to get those guys. And while they're doing that we can start building their enclosure now they're massive creatures diplodocus so we need a fairly big fence and we'll also need a new um what's it called um power thingy okay so there's the limit so let's just go along the map limit i think that should be big enough to be honest for three of them We'll find out soon enough, won't we? When they when they get here. Link that up and then add what's this? Oh there's the gate. Perfect. Pop the gate down just there. And then we need to get a new power station. Oh damn, they're not doing Where's the power station? Am I being blind? Oh, it's under power, isn't it? There we go. And we'll just pop one here. Perfect. So we now got space for them. Why is our score going down? What's happening? What am I missing here? Um, oh, this needs uh, fill up with fuel. This, that's the thing that I keep forgetting as well. You need to fill up with fuel. Uh, I also need a ranger to come and have a look at this guy because he's not... What's happening to our score? It's gone from 2,000 down to 1,700. Hmm. They're all happy. I'm not sure. Free Diplodocus. Oh, no. One evaded us. Okay, so we've only got two. That's a little bit annoying, but we will make do. Asset transportation underway. 
There are actually certain dinosaurs that will like live together. Maybe I should look into that. I'm not sure how that works. So I may give them way too much space to be fair. Let's uh, get this guy to check them both out. Oh, he's already got a full. I think I might need a new response facility, maybe. Just there. And then build a path. There. Perfect. And I'll get. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pause it because they're. I think one of them's hurt. We need to get the medical dude to check him out and see what's going on. Um, so this ranger. No, didn't want to do that. I wanted to do, add the tasks. This ranger doesn't have any. Trolls, so we are going to give him this one. No, not what I wanted to do. That patrol. And. Move Ankylosaurus. I need to get this. No. There. Sign it to that one. And then we need to build one here. Um, I can never remember where they are. Here they are. Build one here. And um, then this guy can... Uh-oh. A storm. Did I just hear? Can do that one. So we then have this guy... Nope, not clicked on the right thing. This guy, who only has... One minute. I need to remove some of these then. One minute, one minute. What's going on? How do you remove patrols? Ah, there you go. So if I take those two off, I think he's only doing this one and that one. Oh my goodness. Oh, damn. What? Tornado. No. Okay. Um, or pause. Frickin' Diplodocuses are gonna go mental. Capture teams. We need these guys. Has he got both of them or just one? Both of them, I think. And then Ranger team. Add a task. To, oh man, repairing this seems a little bit pointless at the moment, but we'll skip. Flipping heck, it's loud as well. <laughs> Everyone's gone mental. Tornadoes just absolutely rip through us. I don't know about Pennsylvania. Do they normally get, like, twisters? Or tornadoes? Okay. Build. Build, build. And then... So he's got post 4, 3, and 6. Shame it doesn't show you which post is which when you click on them. So that's that one. Four. And this one should be three. Yeah. And then this guy. Okay. Uh, one of our ranger. Oh man, hit the facility's down. So we have to repair this using this guy. And we also have to repair these as well. Man, that was a bit mental, wasn't it? Every, the, these guys seem like they're all right. They're not kicking off just yet. Okay. 
Okay, this is taking a lot longer to just to get like settled. Okay, so the, he's back. He's patrolling one and two, which I believe. One, two, and one. So yeah, everyone's got a patrol. And we've now shared it out, so it's not as much. Uh, where's the broken fence? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's how slowly he's plodding towards there. Um, fix that. And do a stats check on these guys as well while you're at it. Oh man. Fix this first. What's going on? What is happening here? Remove the stats check. There we go. And that needs to be priority, but let's see if it is. Are you going to break out, mate? Oh, he's, he's breaking out. <laughs> no. It's all gone wrong here, isn't it? It's gone pink Pete Tong. Luckily, he's moving slow, so... Is he? Oh, he's tranquilized. Okay. Oof. Help transport him back in there. There's a building which is down as well. What building is it? Is it still this one? No, this one's fine. So all buildings are good. These guys are back in. And now we can pause it and just quickly look at their comfort and what's wrong. Population is going to be okay. Cohabitation's fine. Area's more than okay. They need water and tall fruit. And then that's it. So we just need to chuck in some water and tall fruit and they seem like they'll be all right. So let's put... Here, just remembering where everything is now. Let's chuck some more down for these guys, and then tall fruit, tall fiber, tall fruit. To I think that one's probably the best. So chuck this down around here, a little bit around here for them to. I'm surprised they need tall fruit because. They're like kind of long, so they're not. They don't have. They've got a neck which is quite long, but it doesn't go that high. They more like eat stuff off the ground. I think, don't they? I could be wrong. Me talking like I know what I'm talking. Like I know what's going on. on route to pick up the asset. Okay, I think we're back on track, and then our asset ratings should go up. Hopefully. Sending out expeditions to capture new species and ensuring that they are comfortably enclosed and visible for your operatives. So we also have to put down a thing to see them. Um, putting one there should work, to be fair. And then a path to get there. Not the most perfect path, but it will do. Speed this up so they can put the guy down. And then he's doing a status check on them. I need him to do this one first. There you go. Is this post six? One minute. Did I, did I send? No. Post three. Okay. Well, finish that and then go, come and see how these guys are doing. Comfort is a hundred, two thousand. There you go. We need to bring in some more peeps. So we need to send out an expedition. I think maybe we can bring in two baryonics. That should be good. What's this? Why? Why has she got unrest? What's going on? Hmm, interesting. I'm not sure what that means. Maybe I'd send someone else. Maybe she's tired. Thing is we're not we're not struggling with money here. We've got like five mil at the moment. We're absolutely pulling it in. 
I think this is a good space for a for an enclosure as well. Put the baryonyx here. Uh, we're going to need another power thingy. I need to also keep an eye out on... Um, There we go. On uh, the like fuel for the power stuff. I think. Did I finish that? Yeah. Perfect. And then we add a a gate here, and then we'll add a thingy here. Oh, I didn't put food down. Oh, they don't need food. Ah, oh, yes, two out of two. Perfect. I don't need food for the diplo. Oh, I do need power though. Whoops. Quickly. Let's just pause it. I don't think they need food because they've got the trees. Requires a status check. Looking for food. Tall fruits. You got food, right? Do we need a feeder, maybe? No, we've only got fish live and meat so it's definitely just there they've got food Transportation complete. um and then for this guy we're gonna get it's annoying that when you click on something it doesn't let you um okay okay we're making progress but there's always more hey we made it for you, Boom. anyway. <laughs> Take this next objective, for example. Uh, 80%. All captured dinosaurs of eight. Well, he, these guys definitely don't, do they? I need him to come here next. Oh, he's getting run down by an Allosaurus. <laughs> Flip a deck. No, no, no. I need you to come have a look at these guys. The tasks are a little bit funny um, in this. They don't tend to... Um, they it, they just tend to kind of do their own thing. Maybe I'm doing them wrong or something. Where are you off to, mate? Okay. Pause it just quickly so we can see what they're missing. Is it the other guy? Where'd the other guy go? In here somewhere. Where are you at? There he is. So what are they missing? They need plenty of water, quite a lot of rock, quite a lot of forest, and fish. They've got enough area space, so we just need to maybe put forest here and some rocks here. And then some water here with a fish in it. That's my plan. Environment. Forest. Let's put some here. Because they need more. Then rocks. Let's uh, chuck down a few. <laughs> I think these... I mean, could they ask for more with the rocks? Looks beautiful, doesn't it? And then water. We'll put a bunch here. Oh, have some rocks in the water. Nice. And then feeder. We'll have fish just there. So that hopefully should forest. They need more. Okay. Um, rocks they could do with some more and water they could do flip and egg. They need a lot, don't they? Um, so we'll put water a little bit more up here, maybe. No? Won't go up that far. Okay, there you go. And then forest. We'll chuck some around here. And then rocks. We'll put some more biggins like around here. Baff a load in. And then where's he gone? What's what's missing now? Forest still. Flipping heck. 
we've got plenty of rocks, plenty of water, need more forest. So we're going to put some forest at the bottom here. Just around here. Um, forest still. Okay. Flippin' heck, man. These, uh, these guys are really in need of forest. Okay. Maybe I didn't give them a big enough enclosure. It feels a bit, like, cramped in, doesn't it? Now not enough water. So let's grab water. Put some... There's not going to be enough forest now, is there? I guarantee it. No, we're all good. So, if we move that ahead. Are you not going to check on this guy? Apparently not. Hopefully they are all comfortable. 100%. There you go. We just have to hold that for a minute. I quite like this little enclosure, actually. It's quite cute, isn't it? Maybe we do need to put a um, viewing platform in. Just so they can see them. How do you rotate again? Oh, there you go. Oh, I don't think I have anywhere I can put it because of the water. I can put it there, but I don't know if they're going to see them. Mm, this could be a tricky one. Oh, I could pop it there. <laughs> so there's like a proper workaround here. Maybe we just don't watch the baryonics. <laughs> I know what I've got to do. We'll let this mission complete. Pennsylvania. We did it. I did actually need to do what I was just doing there then. Um, continue. Smashed it. This is what we'd hoped to accomplish on Isla Nublar. A place where the dinosaurs could finally thrive. Minus the volcano. Obviously. That's a pretty big minus. I think we can all be proud of what we've accomplished here. But? But what? I can hear it in your voice. Okay, okay. I'm just wondering what Dula is really up to. I don't buy all her saving the future by controlling the past talk. Yeah, Lambert mentioned that some of the animals were being moved to an undisclosed location. He wouldn't say, or maybe he didn't know who was taking delivery, but it wasn't the DFW. Uh-oh, that sounds... Third party? You and I are not invited. Oregon. That sounds a little bit suspicious, doesn't it? I feel like probably the military or someone are trying to get in there and grab some dinos that they can use. We will see. First reports were from Seattle Tacoma Airport's air traffic control, but now we're getting radar hits from Portland International. So they're traveling south. Probably because of the weather. Agreed. They're migrating. But what happens if one of these animals decides to play chicken with a commercial airliner? This is the modern world and the prehistoric one on a collision course. Amazing. So it looks like we get to do uh, pterodactyl stuff now, which is new to this game. So I'm excited oh, about that. Lambert do what they say they can. We're going to need facilities in place for the flyers when they arrive. Let's start with some Avery domes and a hatchery. Oh, we also need an expedition center. And as you heard, time is not on our side. There we go. So I'm going to leave it there and we're going to do the Oregon mission next uh, video. Uh, hopefully you've enjoyed this one. I've really enjoyed it. Um, I'm, I'm really loving just building dinosaur parks again i love the first game this one has got a really different vibe to it but still an interesting one i'm glad they didn't just rehash the same story as the last um game they've done something different and put in some really interesting mechanics so i'm looking forward to getting into some of the newer because we're now getting into some of the newer content as well so like aviaries we've got um 
uh, the dinosaurs, which are like uh, marine reptiles, I believe they're called, because they're not technically dinosaurs. Uh, so you've got like these aquatic dinosaur things which are going on. So I'm looking forward to getting into that stuff soon as well. Um, so yeah, I remember to come back next time and see what we do with all these pterodactyls flying all over the place, like messing with air control. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you when I see you.